Hey guys, just uh, going to put a little raw footage out here for uh, some people who wanted to see real quick what was going on before I tear it down. Um, the machine is put together, uh, X and Y coordinates are running. Obviously there's no Z on it as you can see, the trolley's empty. Um, I'm currently building the stand for it so that I can get it off my assembly table. Um, so the next step for it right now is to tear it down, but I want to do a, a quick shot. Um, I've got the motors dialed in as far as settings go and for those if, if any of you guys are interested um, I can do a quick video on the settings for these motors these uh, big Jiwungus NEMA 34s um, I got a video plan for uh, some explanation about these stepper motors as well as some of the other sizes a more a, a more a better a less formal approach to uh, picking your motors like what I see advice given is, oh, you got to know torque time. Anyways, got a video on the motors coming. But uh, anyways, it's up and running. The motors have been calibrated. So when I tell it to move an inch, it moves an inch. Um, it will travel right now. If I hold down the shift key, it travels better. So rapid traverse is a shift key and an arrow. So there's the X going back and forth. Uh, that's running about 61 inches a minute. Um, I'm still kind of playing with it to get max. Eh, I don't stall at all, either in X or Y, uh, at this rate. This one's running 51 inches a minute. Um, we'll run it back here. And we'll just pretend that that's, uh, that's home for whatever this fixture is. And we'll zero X and Y. And then we can... Uh, run off of those. Whoops, go, let's go. Uh, we'll run off of these a couple inches. So we're just short of five inches on each one. And then if we tell it to go home, <clears throat> go to zero, it'll run it back there about as fast as it can. Now that's actually running faster. That's 70 inches a minute there. So uh, it's overdriving when it's traversing back to zero. And move the camera real quick. Trying out my new Santa tripod. There we go. And I have put the dial indicator back in the other barn, but uh, back in the other shop. But uh, with the cheap dial indicator that I had on here, I could move consistently half a thou. Um, according to the number of steps, so he's got 10,000 steps per inch, so I can do effectively one ten thousandth of an inch. A little foreshadowing, if you have these motors and these five millimeter pitch ball screws, your steps in Mach 3 are 10,160 if you're running direct drive. I'll get more into that in another video. Anyways, this is just a quickie. Talk to you later.